Chromatography is a technique used to separate soluble substances that have been mixed together. It's normally used to separate coloured mixtures like food colourings. We are going to use chromatography to separate these different food colourings into the coloured pigments they are made from. Start by putting chromatography paper down on a clean, flat surface. Now, use a pencil and ruler to draw a straight line about 1cm from the bottom of the paper. Dip a wooden toothpick into the first blue food colouring, in this case we are using blue one. Put a small spot of colour onto the line. Now dip a second toothpick into the next food colouring. For us, it's blue two. Leave about a 1cm gap between each dot. We repeat this with yellow one, yellow two, and then finally with our green food colouring. Then use a pencil to label it. Now attach the paper to a glass rod or pencil using tape. Put some water into your beaker just deep enough that the very end of the paper goes into the water. Carefully lower your paper into the water, letting the glass rod balance on the rim of the beaker. Make sure the pencil line is above the surface of the water. You will notice that the paper absorbs the water and it rises up the chromatography paper past the spots of food colouring. When the water reaches the spots, the pigments will dissolve in the water and move up the paper. Once the water has stopped rising, you can carefully remove it from the beaker. You can see that the food colourings have separated out to form a pattern called a chromatogram. The chromatogram shows us the number of pigments each food colouring contains. This happens because some pigments are more soluble than others. The more soluble the pigment is, the longer it stays dissolved in the water and the further it travels up the paper. The yellow and blue food colourings each contain one pigment. They are pure substances. However, we can see that the green food colouring is a mixture of a blue and yellow pigment. We can tell this because it contains two spots. Thanks for watching. Please share, like and subscribe.